Have you ever felt the sun's warmth and thought, wow, it's hot? This April, many people around the world felt that way. It was the hottest April ever recorded. That means it was hotter than any other April we know about, going back many, many years. Imagine stepping outside and feeling like you're in the middle of summer even though it's only spring. That's what it was like for many of us. What caused this unusual heat? It's a question scientists are working hard to answer. They study the Earth's climate, which is like the planet's long-term weather patterns. Just like we have seasons in a year, the Earth has its own kind of seasons over very long periods. These changes happen over decades, centuries, and even millennia. It's like a slow dance of warming and cooling, but something has changed in the rhythm. The Earth's climate is getting warmer, and this warming trend is happening faster than ever before. Imagine our planet as a giant living being. Just like we get a fever when we're sick, the Earth is experiencing a kind of fever too. This fever is caused by the increasing amount of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. These gases act like a blanket, trapping heat from the sun and warming the planet. The Earth's temperature has been rising steadily over the past century. Scientists have carefully measured this rise using thermometers all over the world, on land, in the oceans, and even from space. This warming trend is not a natural fluctuation. It's being driven by human activities, primarily the burning of fossil fuels like coal, oil, and natural gas. When we burn these fuels, we release large amounts of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. This warming trend has serious consequences for our planet. It's causing glaciers and ice caps to melt, sea levels to rise, and weather patterns to become more extreme. We're seeing more frequent and intense heat waves, droughts, floods, and storms. These changes threaten human health, food security, and the delicate balance of ecosystems around the world. Antarctica, the icy continent at the bottom of the world, holds ancient secrets about Earth's climate. Scientists drill deep into the ice, extracting long cylinders called ice cores. These cores are like time capsules, containing tiny bubbles of air trapped for thousands of years. By analyzing the gases in these bubbles, scientists can reconstruct the Earth's atmosphere from long ago. The ice cores tell a fascinating story. They show that the current levels of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere are higher than they've been in at least 800,000 years. This dramatic increase coincides with the Industrial Revolution, when humans began burning fossil fuels on a large scale. The evidence is clear. Human activities are changing the Earth's atmosphere in a way that's never been seen before. The melting of Antarctic ice is another alarming sign. As the planet warms, the massive ice sheets are slowly melting, adding water to the oceans and contributing to sea level rise. This melting also disrupts the delicate balance of marine ecosystems, affecting penguins, seals, and other creatures that depend on the ice for their survival. Imagine yourself wrapped in a cozy blanket on a chilly night. The blanket traps your body heat, keeping you warm. In a similar way, carbon dioxide, CO2, and other greenhouse gases act like a blanket around the Earth. They trap heat from the sun, preventing it from escaping back into space. When sunlight reaches the Earth, some of it is absorbed by the Earth's surface, warming the planet. The warmed Earth then radiates heat back towards space. However, greenhouse gases in the atmosphere absorb some of this outgoing heat, trapping it near the Earth's surface. This trapped heat warms the planet, just like the blanket keeps you warm. The problem is that we're adding more and more CO2 to the atmosphere by burning fossil fuels. This thickens the CO2 blanket, trapping more heat and causing the Earth's temperature to rise. It's like adding an extra layer to your blanket on a warm night. You're going to get even hotter. Section 5. The 2023 Data, A Year of Extremes. The year 2023 was a stark reminder of the changing climate. It was one of the hottest years on record, with record-breaking heat waves scorching many parts of the world. In Europe, temperatures soared to unprecedented levels, causing widespread wildfires, droughts, and heat-related illnesses. Sea surface temperatures reached record highs, fueling powerful hurricanes and typhoons. These extreme storms caused widespread damage and displacement, leaving a trail of destruction in their wake. The Arctic, known for its icy landscapes, experienced alarming melting, with sea ice extent shrinking to its lowest levels in recorded history. These extreme events are not isolated incidents. They are part of a larger pattern of climate change driven by human activities. 
The data from 2023 paints a clear picture. Our planet is warming, and the consequences are becoming increasingly severe. Section 6. Experts speak, voices from science. Scientists around the world are sounding the alarm about climate change. They have been studying the Earth's climate for decades, collecting data, analyzing trends, and developing models to understand the complex interactions between the atmosphere, oceans, and land. Their findings are clear. Human activities are driving climate change and the consequences are serious. The American Journal of Science, a prestigious scientific publication, has published numerous studies on climate change. These studies provide compelling evidence that the Earth's temperature is rising, sea levels are rising, and weather patterns are becoming more extreme. The journal's editors have called for urgent action to address this global challenge, emphasizing the need for international cooperation and sustainable solutions. PubMed, a vast database of biomedical literature, also contains a wealth of information on the health impacts of climate change. Studies have shown that rising temperatures can lead to increased heat-related illnesses, respiratory problems, and the spread of infectious diseases. These health impacts are particularly concerning for vulnerable populations such as the elderly, young children, and those with pre-existing medical conditions. Climate change is not just a problem for one country or region. It's a global challenge that affects every corner of our planet. From the melting ice caps of the Arctic to the coral reefs of the tropics, the impacts of climate change are being felt worldwide. In the Arctic, rising temperatures are causing sea ice to melt at an alarming rate. This melting not only threatens the survival of polar bears, walruses, and other Arctic wildlife, but also contributes to global sea level rise. In the tropics, warming oceans are bleaching coral reefs, disrupting marine ecosystems and endangering the livelihoods of coastal communities that depend on these reefs for food and tourism. These impacts are interconnected. The melting of glaciers and ice sheets contributes to rising sea levels, which in turn threaten coastal communities around the world. Changes in weather patterns can disrupt agricultural production, leading to food shortages and economic instability. Climate change is a complex issue with far-reaching consequences that require global cooperation and innovative solutions. The good news is that we can all play a part in addressing climate change. Every small step we take can make a difference. By making conscious choices in our daily lives, we can reduce our carbon footprint and contribute to a healthier planet. One simple step is to conserve energy. Turn off lights when you leave a room, unplug electronics when not in use, and choose energy-efficient appliances. You can also reduce your reliance on cars by walking, biking, or taking public transportation whenever possible. These small changes can add up to significant energy savings. Another important step is to reduce, reuse, and recycle. Choose products with minimal packaging, reuse items whenever possible, and recycle paper, plastic, glass, and metal. By reducing our waste, we conserve resources and minimize the amount of garbage that ends up in landfills. We all share this beautiful blue planet, and it's our responsibility to protect it for future generations. Climate change is a serious threat, but it's not insurmountable. By working together, we can make a difference. We can support policies that promote clean energy, reduce greenhouse gas emissions, and invest in sustainable solutions. We can educate ourselves and others about the impacts of climate change and the importance of taking action. We can also inspire change in our communities by supporting local initiatives that promote environmental sustainability. Remember, every action counts. By making conscious choices and working together, we can create a brighter future for our planet and all its inhabitants. If you're curious to learn more about climate change and what you can do to help, there are many resources available. Facts. Academy 0122 is a reliable source for educational content on a wide range of topics, including climate change. You can also find information on websites like NASA's Climate Kids and the National Geographic Kids website. Don't be afraid to ask questions, explore different perspectives, and engage in conversations about climate change. The more we understand about this issue, the better equipped we'll be to address it. Remember, knowledge is power, and by learning and sharing what we know, we can inspire positive change. 
Together, let's be the generation that turns the tide on climate change and creates a healthier, more sustainable future for our planet. Pause to S. Picture this. A summer day so perfect it feels like a scene from a movie. The sun is shining brightly in a clear blue sky, casting a golden glow over everything it touches. Children are laughing and playing in the park, their joy echoing through the warm air. Families are gathered for picnics, sharing stories and making memories that will last a lifetime. The ice cream truck jingles down the street, offering a sweet escape from the heat. It's a day where time seems to slow down and everyone is savoring the simple pleasures of life. Pause to S. But beyond the fun and games, there's a deeper story unfolding. This summer, like many others before it, is a reminder of the beauty and fragility of our planet. The warmth we feel on our skin is a gift, but it's also a call to action. As we bask in the sun's rays, we must remember that our actions today will shape the summers of tomorrow. Pause to S. Let's cherish these moments, but let's also commit to protecting them. By making small changes in our daily lives, we can ensure that future generations will have their own perfect summer days to remember. Together, we can make a difference. Let's turn this summer of warmth into a summer of hope and action. Pause to S. Because every sunny day is a chance to create a better world for all of us. Pause to S. Welcome to our journey of understanding the Earth's warming trend and how we can all play a part in making a positive change. This is where it begins. Pause 3 S. Now, let's dive into the story of April, the hottest one yet. Pause 3 S. Have you ever felt the sun's warmth and thought, wow, it's hot? This April, many people around the world felt that way. It was the hottest April ever recorded. That means it was hotter than any other April we know about, going back many, many years. Imagine stepping outside and feeling like you're in the middle of summer even though it's only spring. That's what it was like for many of us. What caused this unusual heat? It's a question scientists are working hard to answer. They study the Earth's climate, which is like the planet's long-term weather patterns. Just like we have seasons in a year, the Earth has its own kind of seasons over very long periods. These changes happen over decades, centuries, and even millennia. It's like a slow dance of warming and cooling, but something has changed in the rhythm. The Earth's climate is getting warmer, and this warming trend is happening faster than ever before.